assalamu alaikum guys welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here so i would just like to wish everyone happy ramadan and ramadan mubarak so this is the month of ramadan it is one of the most blessed months of the year and uh by the end of ramadan during the last 10 days we have uh laid of other which is one of the most blessed nights of the whole year and for us Muslims, it's a big blessing because we get to redeem ourselves from everything we have done in the past and all the sins. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is giving us one day, one night basically, to recover from everything that we have done. So it is a big blessing for us and we shouldn't let it go to waste. So today I'm going to be talking more about uh, Laylatul Qadr and the Surah and what to read and what our Prophet Muhammad wasalam, said. So let's get into this video. So moving on to what is Laylatul Qadr. Laylatul Qadr is the night of decree. On that very night, the Quran was also revealed, which is a big thing for all Muslims over here in this world because the Quran is the book of guidance. It has taught us many things and it is the word of Allah. So Laylatul Qadr is really hard to find, as we all know, because it is in the last 10 nights of Ramadan. But to be more specific, during the last uh, 10 nights and the odd nights uh, during those 10 nights. So, for example, for 21st Ramadan, 23rd Ramadan, 25th Ramadan, 27th Ramadan, and 29th Ramadan. It could be any one of these nights. In fact, Laylatul Qadr is so important for us mankind as Allah has even given us a whole surah about it in the Quran, Surah Al Qadr, which is also the 97th surah of the Quran. Now, I'm going to be sharing the translation. So the first ayah is, indeed, we sent the Quran on the night of Laylatul Qadr. Verse 2 means, what can make you know what is the night of decree? Verse 3, the night of decree is better than a thousand months. Verse 4, the angels and spirits descend by the permission of their Lord. Verse 5, which is the last verse of the surah, peace is until the sun Rises. That was the translation of Surah Al Qadr. Moving on, Hazrat Aisha radiallahu anhu also asked the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, peace be upon him, what surah or what dua should we read, read during the night of Laylatul Qadr? The Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said, there is also a hadith uh, for Laylatul Qadr which says, whoever spends the night of Laylatul Qadr, the night of decree praying to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and asking forgiveness for all his previous sins, he will be forgiven, inshallah. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you all have an amazing Ramadan and uh, we find a little color this year, inshallah. And may Allah bless you with all his blessings 